Today we're going to be doing column multiplication. So we start out by laying our question out like this. We're going to do 3 multiplied by 6 to start with, which is 18. I shall write that here, making sure that the 10s are lined up with the 10s and the 1s are lined up with the 1s. 3 times 3, I know is 9, but it's actually 30, don't forget, so it's 3 times 30, which is 90. 10s lined up with 10s, units lined up with units, add them together, 8 and nothing is 8. 1 and 9 makes 10. No hundreds to add, apart from this one, answer 108. Another example, slightly bigger numbers this time. 4 times 6, I know that's 24. 10s lined up with 10s. Units lined up with units. 4 times 5, 4 times 50, so that would be 200. So the 2 in hundreds, 0, 0. Add it all together at the end again. 4 and nothing makes 4. 2 and nothing. It's 2, 2 and nothing again, 2, answer 224. In this next example, we're using hundreds, tens, and ones, times ones. So exactly the same process. 3 times 5, I know that's 15. Making sure the tens and ones are lined up with the tens and ones. 5 times 9, I know that's 45, but don't forget it's not 9, it's 90. So it's 450, 10 times bigger. Hundreds tens and ones and lastly five lots of 100 or 500 hundreds tens and ones same again add them all up at the end five and nothing and nothing makes five one and five makes six nothing 60 four and five here makes nine answer 965 this last example is the biggest one yet Exactly the same process. I know that 6 times 3 is 18. Lining up the 10s and the 1s. 6 times 7, well I know that's 42, so 6 times 70 would be 10 times bigger, 420. Hundreds, 400, 10s, 20 units. And then finally, 6 times 4, I know that's 24. So 6 times 40 would be 240, so 6 times 400 would be 2,400. So I've got thousands to add in this time, 2,400. Add them all together at the end, 8 and nothing and nothing makes 8. 1 and 2 and nothing is 3 or 30. 400 and 400 makes 800. 2,000 and nothing makes 2,000. Answer 2,838.